Now we've got diesel national average price today at 558 and we're hearing that gas and diesel prices are going to go up a lot more this summer. In fact, JP Morgan is predicting $6 gas this summer. What do you think that will do to your state, that, those kind of prices? Yeah, that's going to put a, a huge burden uh, on not only our farmers and ranchers with the cost of diesel, but just uh, everyday households because that's a big part of their budget. You know, and this is where the Biden administration has really failed with their war on fossil fuels. They haven't taken a balanced approach. They haven't allowed, I don't think they've had a successful uh, auction of federal land for oil since they've been in office. Those things used to happen every quarter, every six months. Uh, they just canceled them in Alaska and the Gulf of Mexico. And when you start cutting off the supply, like the Biden administration has, of course, uh, and demand just keeps going up, especially with the war in Russia and Ukraine. Uh, it just means prices are going to go up. I mean, the Biden administration is responsible for these high prices. Are the folks in Nebraska angry about this? Oh, yeah. Nobody's happy about paying more. And again, it gets back to what we're talking about for our farmers and ranchers mm. with even though corn prices are at a 10-year high and it's up 50 percent, when you have diesel up as much as it is, yeah. it's a real hit on their, uh, on their budget.